Hello, my name is Martyr, and welcome to a new Let's Play series, Saturday Morning RPG. I told you it was going to be a Let's Play series. Did you listen? Probably not, but that's okay. Because we're going to be doing it together now. We're going to be playing this from beginning to end. If you're not familiar with what Saturday Morning RPG is, that's okay. There's going to be a little pop-up right here. Bloop. And you can click on that, and it'll take you to my video review that I did about on it a while back now. So to prove to you guys that I'm going to be doing a, uh, an entire new Let's Play series, we're going to go ahead and click this delete button, and that'll take us right back to the beginning, start a new, new uh, save file. And I kind of love the music of this game. So we're playing this from beginning to end together. I love this game. It has a, it's a shout out to old 80s cartoons. It has a lot of fun interactive gameplay, and I just am curious to see how this game ends. So can manly man stop Commander's hood heinous plans? Find out after these messages from our sponsor. That's our main character sleeping, which if I had to guess the entire first level is probably just uh, Marty's dream here. Also, it's kind of fortuitous that you know, Martyr, he's Marty. I get called Marty so freaking many times. It's not even funny. You're too late, Marty. Samantha, the one you love will soon be mine. There's nothing you can do to stop me. You're wrong. You're a bad guy, and bad guys never win. <laughs> oh, wait. Your hopeless confidence and optimism amuses me. But enough talk. How about you? I get called Marty so often, it's not even just pisses me off how much I get called Marty. All right, let's do it. Punch him, Marty. Alright, I have to get practice at that. Seriously? That's the best you've got. It ain't even worth the time it would take to crush you myself. Teach this little pest a lesson. I have a wedding to plan. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Beat him up, Marty! Hint, hint, I might have played this part before. We're supposed to lose here. Bad guys never win. What a joke. Get lost, nerd. Or we'll grind into the dust again. I feel worse, I could have shot him. Dude, that was so not cool. Yeah, they totally schooled you. Of course, you're pretty much done taking out Commander Hood unarmed. He's the baddest bad guy around. But he kidnapped Samantha and plans to make her marry him. I couldn't just stand there. If you're going to take on Commander Hood, you're going to need some help. I am the wizard, and I'm here to grant you an ancient power. Whoa, what the heck is... Keep it down. Dude, this takes a lot of concentration. I love this game. Take this artifact, Marty. It will grant you the power you need to destroy Commander Could and save Samantha. Uh, this is a notebook. Yes, a notebook of ancient power. With it, you can use items to find in the world as powerful weapons. Anything's notebook touched will be affected by its magic. How can this be possible? There's no such thing as a magical notebook. Fine, you don't have to believe me. See for yourself. Hey guys, do you hear what this jerk has to say about your mothers? What? My mother was a saint. Well, hold on a minute, I didn't say anything. Oh man, I'm gonna die. So yes, we've played through this part before. It's kind of just a tutorial area. Uh, oh God, I'm gonna... As you can tell, this is no ordinary notebook. The stickers you scratch give you powerful boosts in battle. In addition to the notebook, can store your objects that can pummel enemies. Defeat this guy by using those objects. Like I said, this, we've, this, we've already got this before. This is kind of just a uh, tutorial-esque uh, starting area, I think you guess you could say. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, wait, how do I... Wait, go back. No, I don't want to restart the battle. Wait, no. There we go. I remember the controls now. How do we flip? Okay, so we have no choice but to use this. Let's go ahead and use uh, the CD again. I'm still reminding myself how to use the controls and all that. I realize we don't have access to the battery quite yet. Yeah, Ranksy, we'll get better. Give me a minute. All right, I'm still for reminding myself of the freaking controls. Dot dot dot. You, you knocked my buddy. Time to die for the good of the hood. That doesn't sound right. All right, there you go. Yeah, let's do this. I've unlocked the full range of abilities held by your notebook, Marty. 
Now you're playing with power. In addition to using objects to attack, you can generate power from batteries. The power builds up a charge that will boost the attack's effect of those attacks. Blech. Charging uses up your magic power. Magic can be restored through defending against attacks or punching enemies. So let's do that, guys. This is the part where I say we're going to break our um, Z button on this thing. On my keyboard. Ah, he shot me! What freaking turd! Yeah! Boom! Okay, let's just, let's just punch up. We should be able to defeat him like this. Yeah! 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 <laughs> B. See, we're getting better. I'm starting to get, get, uh, catch up on how to do this. That that was radical! Told you, but don't get cocky, kid. You still have to travel to the far side of Gaia if you want to rescue Samantha. That won't be easy. Commander Hood's goons, Skelebor, and Madeline are all waiting. They'll do anything they can to stop you. With this power, I feel ready to take on the world. I love this power. It's so bad. <laughs> what the hell was that, dude? All right, guys. So we're officially now in the game world, uh, where we have our hoverboard. We have access to several abilities, including our um, notebook. We have stickers, which we can change out. Matter of fact, we might want to go ahead and change out some of our stickers right now. Uh, I think we might switch out the magic plus five because I don't really see myself running out of magic very often. Health is very useful. Accuracy, pretty useful. Enemy strength. Let's switch out defense. I'm going to be more of an attacker, I think. Let's go with strength. Uh, enemy strength, accuracy, health. What is this one? Speed. Uh, let's go with enemy negative speed because I seem to get hit a lot by my enemies. And then, of course, we'll have to change our uh, cover, which I'm thinking we might go with this one for now. Oh, that sounds good. All right. This, we don't have any money, so we can't really do anything with, I don't think. Yeah, we only really have 15 bucks. All right, so there we go. There we go. We started, we got the basic start of the game. We're going to go to Gurgletail's Cave, because there is a side quest in this place to, I think, get the, the equivalent of the Smurfs, basically. We got Marty added a, a color belt, just some leftovers from last night's dinner. The little girl made the best rainbow jumble I've ever had. All right, so we'll, actually we're gonna probably equip that really quick. Uh, let's go here. We got the Care Bear one, which we're gonna change up the Zebra Stripe one, and then we're gonna change up Michael Jackson Club because I don't want Michael Jackson Club. There we go. We're also going to save really quick. Your game is successfully saved. There we go. We're going to close this. Uh, did we get a new cover? I doubt it, did we? Okay, there we go. Bon ami, mon cher. I need you to help me with something. You familiar with the jerks? Jerks? The little green guys with live in the swamp? Hey, wait a minute. I know you. You're Gurgletail. You're the guy who's always trying to eat the jerks on that sh the show. Oh, and that's your pet, Crowdad Raphael. Yep, that's me. As you're more than likely guessed, I'm fixing to eat some of them jerks. Body rum from that's why I need you. Can you help me out and bring some jerks? Yeah, I'll pick up any jerks I can find. Good. Come back when you've got five jerks. I'm fixing to make some jerk jambalaya. <laughs> you got a bushbone. Where does this go? I don't know. What's the story, Wishbone? You guys remember that show? Wishbone. It was about the dog traveling through history. It was a weird show. Anyways, let's get along here. Let's move along. I'd say, guys, I've been looking forward to this Let's Play series for a long time. God knows we played um, Final Fantasy VI for just ages, man. It was just ages we played that. Oh, crap, we got a scratch. All right, that works out. We're going to go ahead and rapidly charge. That's pretty good. 3.8 is pretty much... Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and let's Care Bear stare his butt. All right, perfect. Not exactly what I was hoping for, but it works. Right, the basketball burns enemies. I remember now. If we also miss, oh, that's okay. We'll just beat the shit out of him. I still remember how to play the game. It's been a while since I played it last. We got a B. They're saying we sucked overall. Could have done better damage. They're probably right. 
I can smell him on you working with Gurgatomon. Sure, we'll back off. Oh wait, you're coming with me. All right, there we go. Um, the, so the wish, but wait. I feel like we should be able to pick that up. Okay, no, I don't want it to access my book right now. Oh, whatever. We'll come back later. Let's kill this guy. And see what we get access to after this. We got two enemies here. Oh, I keep forgetting we got Scratch, man. I always forget that one. I don't know why. Creates a defensive shield. Let's do it. Not a great defense, but... I love that. His hair is glowing. Rainbow colors. How freaking awesome is that? Alright, and then we're going to charge up. Uh, over 9,000. Alright, 4.0. Oh, we should really easily kill one of these guys. That shield didn't last very long, though. Alright, he's dead. We'll charge up again. Oh, uh, yeah, let's do this. Alright. And then, uh, I don't see why Reed should change things up. Let's just go ahead and kill him with this. Yep, he's dead. Totally dead. Massive amount of damage there. I like that a lot. All right, perfect. And a, we got some. We got four bucks, and a new sticker. What sticker did we get, guys? We got the banana sticker. C for stickers. I already have the banana sticker. Bull crap. All right, whatever. Let's go. Get get back on your board. Mad Eli, what is this? How could a puny worm like you make it past my lizard minions? Aren't you mad, Eline? I am I mad, Eline? Of course you feeble minded simpleton. And you should cower in fear for I'm the most powerful sorceress. Powerful, yeah, right. This cool cat, the wizard gave me this nifty notebook. I want to wipe the floor with you. Insolent insect. You will regret those words. You will never make it to Commander Hood, for you will fall into my hands. I love this game so much. All right, I got scratched up. All right, looks. I think we got it. I'm pretty sure we got it. All right, so let's just beat the crap out of her. Got to our usual 3.8. Uh, this is definitely a boss fight. One of the first of many boss fights I'm feeling throughout this Let's Play series. We're gonna go ahead and uh, use our CD. Oh, I totally missed it. That's okay. That's all right. Blew through 90% of her health there. We'll just punch her. I think we'll be able to. Oh, uh, yeah. Beat the shit out of myself. Okay. Not exactly. We'll, we'll use the basketball. Radical. Totally burned him. Burned her, I should say. Alright. Uh, charge up. Uh, yeah. Perfect. And then we'll use our CD here. Nice. Alright, not as good an attack as I was hoping. Let's do this. Perfect. Um, I think we're just gonna punch her. Yikes. She turned into a freaking fireball, man. Bitch. Alright. Let's do this! Uh, we only got to 2.6 because we ran out of magic power. Alright, this should be enough to defeat her though. Ow. Yeah, I think we killed her. We got a C, that great. We go strength or defense. I think we should go with our strength for now. So we gotta level up, we got some more cash, we ran up a rank. It's a rank C. Defeat the first boss. All oh, ooh. All in all good, we'll probably just go ahead and face this guy. And then we'll call it a day. That's the first boss down though. Holy crap. There's a lot of these guys. Alright, we're gonna have to kill them. I got four. Ah, oh, he poisoned me. Alright. Let's uh I think we should aim for the weaker targets first. That, I just think that's a good tactic, just to eliminate some of these guys. Yeah, like, see, that's what I was—that's what I was aiming to do right there. I do—I have played this game a little bit. I do kind of know what I'm doing. 
somewhat. Getting some good radical defenses off. <laughs> Alright, all that's left now is him. We'll do one more charge. Uh, yeah. Oh, we ran out of MP. That's what happened there. Crap all Um. Let's do the Care Bear Stare and see what happens. We missed. Not good at all. Um. Mm. Let's try this, I guess. Oh, I got po I just totally missed. Alright, so we hit him with that. This poison might just do us in here, man. This poison's just vicious. We got a righteous defense off and burned him a little bit. Alright, you know what? I think we should just punch him and hope for the best. Nice! We do that one more time, and it'll be done. Righteous defense. Booyah! Two in a row. That was pretty sweet, guys. We got B on that, and end the combat there. We got seven bucks for that. It looks like we should have a fair, decent amount of cash. Let's see here how much cash we have. Um, no, 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 no. V for open. Ah! Okay. V! How much cash do we have? We have 38 bucks. That's not bad. We're going to save here. We're going to call it here, guys. As always, if there's game one to play, tweet me, Martyr HJ. Uh, we did pretty good there. I'm going to head back, see if we can get some stuff out of that vending machine, though. And that's a pretty quickly done with our little nifty uh, flag. Then we get a pizza slice, a cookie, which we already have, a, pizza, a ruler, a Walkman. Wow, look at these ones. They cost 61 bucks. Oh, we might want to save up for that. Yeah, we might want to save up for that, guys. So, I hope you enjoy this new Let's Play series. I know I'm really looking forward to playing this game with you guys. It should be a total blast. Just the, all the crazy 80s reference. So far, we got the Smurfs. and I don't know who the hell Madeline's from. She probably is from He-Man, if I had to guess. I could be wrong. Or she's just one of the crazy Commander Hood's minions. Who knows? Anyways, we will see you next time.